this time we're going to show you how to um, make a TechIt server. TechIt, not TechIt Classic, not TechIt Lite, TechIt, the one with space and all that shit. So, first of all, you're going to need the actual Technic launcher itself so you can download the TechIt mod, which you probably have, but if you don't, you can find that in the link in the description and just press on Windows and that will start the download. Once you have that, you're going to want to get Hamachi. Um, this you won't need, as far as I know, you won't need if you want to do it yourself, but I imagine you're making a server so that you can play with your friends. So here you're just going to want to press on download now on the unmanaged, uh, of course, and tick the conditions. And then just install that. I already have it installed, so I'm not going to show you. But after that, go on to the other link and come over here and press on server download this I don't have so we'll actually show you what to do with it so once it's downloaded which will take a couple more seconds here once it's downloaded open it up make sure you have WinRAR or 7-zip um, not gonna have a link for that in the description because most people already do have it and if you don't you can just search it up on Google so while you're while you're doing this I recommend opening up the Technic Launcher and if you don't already, make sure that you actually have TechIt installed. So here it will say install. So because it will take a while, so if you don't, then go ahead and do that. Uh, so once you've done that, go make a make a folder and call it whatever you want. I just called mine TechIt server. And then uh, just extract everything in here into that into that folder. Then you can turn that off. So once you've done that, you can press on Minecraft Server 1.6.4, and just to chill, to launch it, this will make all the um, the stuff they need to make and the world and all that. Okay, once you've done that, press over here and type in stop. Don't just X out of it. I mean, you can just do that, but it it's not as good. Just type in stop and press enter, of course, and then wait for it to actually finish and turn off. Now that it's off, um. Make sure your friend also has Hamachi. So just open up Hamachi. It will ask you to make a profile. I already have one. Once you have one, just press on the power button. This will log you in. And then, now once it's logged in, all right. Once it's logged in, just uh, just go over here, right click and press on copy PV4 address, not PV6, PV4. And then when your friend wants to join into your Hamachi server, he's going to press on network and then join an existing network. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, before that, to make a, a network so that your friend can join, press on create a new network and then type in a network ID, which is pretty much just whatever you want to call yourself. In this case, I'm just going to write in uh, bomb cheeks because I'm an idiot. And then a password, so I'm just going to write in 1234 and then confirm 1234 and create <laughs> it's already been taken of course bump cheeks uh, th uh, there create that alright now that's done so your friend is gonna also go on join an existing network he's gonna write in bump cheeks 13445 and then 1234 here I'm just gonna just probably delete this there <laughs> anyway so you're gonna want to have this open and he's gonna want to have his open so he can actually join after that, go into your server uh, properties, uh, open it up with notepad, mine is just default to do that anyway, and then through these settings, all you really need to change is um, go down to server, you can change the seed if you want, but go down to server IP. So when you copied your PV4, that's going to be the server IP, so just type, uh, either do just copy and paste, or you can do CTRL and V. So that will be that. Then if you want a whitelist, you can write that to true. PvP, you can write that to false if you want. Difficulty, 1 is easy, 0 is peaceful, 2 is normal, and 3 is hard. I think 4 is hardcore. Uh, game mode, just keep that as 0. Max players, uh, the lower it is, the better your server will run. So if it's only going to be like 2 of your friends, then you know, just have it 3. Just have it to whoever is going to be playing, that's how many you want. Here you can just rename it, this, this is just what it will say when, when your friend types in the IP, so you can just write in uh, friends tech it right all right after that you just want to go over to file and then press on save and you can exit out of that uh, to make yourself OP you can just type in your minecraft name here if you want to make your friend OP too then just press space and then type in his name to file save exit out 
and that's pretty much it when you actually want to launch the server uh, some people say that my pressing on minecraft server 1.6.4 doesn't work for them and in including me so for those who that doesn't work for press on the launch.bat file instead this will load up your server as well so you can have that in the background now I'm just going to show you that it works uh, I can't really test it with a friend but I can just show you that at least I can join um, now I have done this before I have played with my friends so I know that it works but now we're just going to wait a very long time for tech it to load up because it has a lot of mods in it alright now the minecraft has finally loaded in you just press on multiplayer mine's already here but pretend it isn't go to add server you can call it whatever you want me and my friend tech it server address uh, you will have already copied it by pressing the pv4 so ctrl and v done and there's your server so you can join in make sure that it actually works here and here we are we're in the server it's all loading up now so your friend would also be you know he'll also be able to join he would also spawn here so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did a like and a subscribe would be very appreciated if you have any problems or questions feel free to leave a comment down below and i'll try my best to answer it for you anyway i'll see you in the next video bye